Hello everyone, Red Panda Bricks here, back again for another LEGO video. Today I will be going over a leak for the Marvel CMF series based off the Disney Plus shows. So for number one on the list, we have the Scarlet Witch final outfit, which, yeah, I think that makes sense. If we don't get her in any, like, Multiverse of Madness sets, that would make sense to include her here. Next, we also have White Vision, which again makes sense. Because a lot of these are probably going to be figures that we wouldn't get anywhere else. For number three, we have Monica Rambeau. Probably her final version. Maybe another version from one of the episodes. But we also have Falcon as Captain America. Which we haven't seen that yet as of recording in the show. We have the Winter Soldier. Which I'm sure that means Bucky. There was a leak a while ago of a uh, Bucky Barnes from the Falcon and Winter Soldier torso. Which, so that's probably true. We have Loki for number six. For number seven is Lady Loki. And there's a few more of characters that haven't been officially revealed. But are in this leak. And for number eight we have Peggy Carter as Captain America. Which we've seen already. For number 9 we have Zombie Captain America. Number 10 we have What If Steve Rogers Was Spider-Man. So in the What If series there's going to be a lot of Captain America focused stuff I see. We have Black Panther as Star-Lord. And for number 12 we have Gamora as Thanos. So for my uh, thoughts on this. For characters like Lady Loki and like Steve Rogers as Spider-Man, Lego should have been more secretive. Because they did the same thing with Shang-Chi and the Legend of Ten Rings, where there was a character where people thought it was Death Dealer, but it wasn't really confirmed yet. But in the Lego sets that some people got early, it says Death Dealer. So it's no longer a mystery. And like, Lady Loki has not been at all officially revealed, it's only been a theory, and now, because of these leaks, which LEGO didn't keep secretive enough, now people know about it. All I'm saying is, they didn't even allow, like, accurate Avengers Endgame sets, yet, leaks are gonna be there. There's also a, uh, leak that Frog Thor is gonna be an accessory. I'm not really sure who he would come with. I think probably What If. Or maybe Loki. Now, as for what I think of each character. Uh, Wanda in her final Scarlet Witch outfit. I think that's great. When I saw that outfit in the show, I was like, wow, that's a good looking outfit. And it's probably the best one to make into a... Uh, to make into a Lego minifigure. Same with like White Vision. If we didn't get him in this, it'd be a long, long time till we get him in a figure. I do think they should have had characters from the uh, sitcom based episodes, but since they didn't go with sitcom based characters, I feel like the ones they chose were pretty good. Although instead of Monica Rambo, they should have gone with like fake Pietro, that would have been a better choice. As for Loki, I'm not really sure. I don't think we've seen any, like, his, like, suit in the show. And I don't think it'd be a, just a better version of the 2012 Avengers Loki. It'll probably be, like, the President Loki, as we've seen in the trailers. As for Falcon Captain America, though, I mean, we haven't seen him yet. So that does sound like the best choice to go with for him. And Bucky Barnes, according to that leak I mentioned earlier, it'll probably just be his regular outfit, which isn't bad. It's just maybe not the best. They should have had like the fake Captain America, the new Captain America, I guess. Uh, Marvel's What If Peggy Carter is Captain America? Yeah, okay. Although, if you've seen the trailer, as Captain America, she has like 
the British flag, so it's not really much of Captain America, but pretty good choice. What if Zombie Captain America? No, that does sound like a good choice. The only thing is, they also have Captain America Spider-Man. Like, there's too many Captain Americas in this. There's like four Captain Americas. Why do they need to be so many? And then they have Black Panther Star-Lord, which I think is great because that's one of the most, like, different ones. Two bizarrely different characters. Good. What if Gamora was Thanos? I mean, I could have had a better character to choose. But yeah, there's not really much to this. I also can't state too much about a lot of these characters because we haven't seen them yet in the show. And Frog Thor, that just sounds like a completely good idea. Even if he doesn't fit, just throw it in with like white vision. I don't care. <laughs> but yeah, that's about it for this leap. Let me know in the comments down below what you think of this. What characters would you rather have seen? Which characters would you rather have not seen? Please like the video if you enjoyed. Please subscribe. Thank you for watching. And goodbye.